Alright guys, welcome back to another video of KingX.X Come to you guys with a brand new video And today we have a video talking about some brand new weapons that are coming to the game Possibly very soon in the next coming week, 4 or 5 weeks from now Maybe a little bit more, depending on how Infinite Warfare wants to actually get these released Or Infinity Ward really But yeah, for one, I've been trying to make this video for about 2 hours Literally, it is 2.41, I started at 12 o'clock It's absolutely insane there's been tons of like audio issues and stuff, so my audio is messing up a lot and it's annoying. But for one, could you guys do me a big favor? Hit that subscribe button, really help a lot. Try and tip my goal of 1800 subscribers. Also, put on post notifications, really helps my channel out a lot, and it also will help you out a lot as well because you guys will be notified when you get my videos and be the very first people to see it. So that's pretty lit. But for one, the very first weapon is the Atlas. It is an LMG. Now, for one, there is a reload clip pretty much similar to the Trencher. Some people are actually saying it almost looks like the stoner, like kind of like, I don't know, people say it looks like the stoner from BO1. I don't really see the resemblance, but the weapon is, it's an LMG, ballistic fire, so it shoots actual bullets and not energy bolts, so that's pretty cool. Automatic, of course, and it actually has a pretty cool reload because you literally, like, you fling the clip out of your hand and out of the gun, so it's pretty cool. I actually want to talk about that video or that in another video because there's actually gameplay of it, and I want to actually let you guys know about that one. But we also have the Ragent EMX, and that also is known as the Tack Burst. I'm guessing that there's something called, it says Perk SMG Tack Burst, but the gun is called the Ragent EMX. And it is also an SMG, a three-round burst SMG, and the closest thing I could say it relates to is pretty much the Vesper from BO3, but with the Cheekum or the R3K mixed into it, which is pretty cool as well. At first, I really thought this gun was actually similar to the Cheekum and also like the FMG when I first saw it but then I looked at the body a little bit more and that's when I thought it looked like the Vesper as well I don't know maybe you guys see a kind of similar resemblance to what I see as well but mainly like how the gun fires and all that stuff just I don't know by the way I forgot to say this I'll actually leave a link down below because I'm not trying to get a copyright strike from Activision or Infinity Ward talking about these new weapons so I'm definitely not showing no pictures that's why I'm kind of just explaining the descriptions and stuff like that but the weapon does seem like it has some pretty good accuracy, damage, mobility, all that type of stuff. So I could clearly see this gun is actually going to be pretty lit. And I'm actually hyped to use it because it is three round burst. So it could be like a one burst kill SMG or maybe two burst. I don't know. Depends. Looks pretty lit though. Then we have the Venom X. Now for one, the Venom X, it actually has like a placeholder as the P-Law, which is a launcher. But for some odd reason, it has it in the primary weapon area. I don't know exactly what this weapon's gonna be. I mean, I would think it would've been like a launcher or something like that because it's the P-Law is like the placeholder for it. But it's a little weird because I don't know, it doesn't really explain much, but it's in the primary section. I don't know. Let me know if you guys know anything about the Venom X. Let me know. Probably, watch it be like an SMG or assault rifle or something, and I'm just like completely dumb. Maybe it's a shotgun. I don't even know. But it could be anything, really. I um, I was leaning more towards like a rocket launcher or something. But yeah, that's just me. We also have two melee weapons coming to the game very soon. And it is actually pretty much reskins from Black Ops 3. You know how everybody from like the Battlefield community or just like any other gaming community, especially like, like first person shooter communities and stuff, they always say Call of Duty is like the same game over and over and all they do is reskin and everything. Well, pretty much they got the Katana and also the Nunchucks. If you guys did not know, the Nunchucks and also the Katana was also in BO3. And also they are on Shaolin Shuffle as well, just so nobody gets triggered. Like I say, just BO3, it is in Shaolin Shuffle. So pretty much however they worked in Shaolin Shuffle, it's pretty much going to work exactly the same way when you're actually using them online. So yeah. That's pretty cool, I guess. I mean, I don't even got the nunchucks or the katana, whatever it is, and zombies anyways. But I ain't doing no Easter egg for them, or whatever you have to do. I forgot, honestly. I don't even care. Forget zombies. Only Rave in the Redwoods is a good one. But for one, probably my favorite... I just wanted to throw this out there. For one, my favorite, like, weapon, my melee weapon or something like that, was the boxing gloves. Let me know what yours was, because really, I like the boxing gloves from BO3. It's pretty cool. Honestly, it actually reminds me of something. The Mayweather and Pac or Mayweather and Conor McGregor fight. Let me know who you guys are actually going for. If you guys are going for anybody, because the fight is in like a month though, it's pretty lit. But I'm getting off topic at this point. I was just talking about boxing gloves, new weapons. I'm super hyped for. By the way, there will be a double upload today, which is pretty awesome, and it's gonna be talking about the Atlas LMG very soon as well. 
and I'm gonna let you guys know all about that in the next video. But yeah, if you guys did like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment you guys when you see next. I will post more videos in the future. I want my goal of 1,800 subscribers. Put on post notifications so you guys will be the very first people to see my video. And yeah, guys, I'm out.